Beauty and Parenting Consultant. In today's video, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the very special period that comes after your baby is born. And this is called the postpartum period. For many people, it is supposed to be an exciting time. When people visit you, they're congratulating you. It is celebration time. But for many mothers, it may not really seem to be the same celebration that everybody around them is seeming to experience. Now, there are many changes that happen, both physical and emotional. Let me start a little bit with the physical changes. Now, the first thing that I would like to tell you is that you are going to look seven months pregnant on the day that you deliver. Please remember, your uterus has grown to the size of a watermelon and it is going to take a few weeks to shrink back to the pear-shaped size that it was before you got pregnant. The other thing that's going to happen is you're going to feel super hot because your body had created a lot of fluids to support the pregnancy and these are going to shed. So feeling hot and sweaty is very common. And here's the paradox. You are asked to switch off the air conditioner, keep the fans off and definitely wear something warm all the time. And this is a complete myth. You're also going to start bleeding. This is called your postpartum lochia flow. It may seem like a menstrual cycle, but it really is not your period. It is just the uterus cleansing itself and the site where the placenta had implanted is also bleeding. So this is a completely normal phenomena and can last for anywhere between 15 to 40 days. If you had a vaginal birth, you will also need to take care of your stitches. This is your episiotomy, which is done in the vaginal area. Besides this, if there was a surgical birth, then you need to care for your C-section stitches as well. Now, besides all of this, there are a lot of emotional upheavals, ups and downs that you might be experiencing. Postpartum mood swings, postpartum baby blues, postpartum depression. These are all real things and we need to accept this as a reality. Please ensure that you talk to someone, you communicate with someone, share what you are feeling. It is very important that you find time to do things that you enjoy rather than only following instructions by everybody else. Please remember, pregnancy is a very normal event. It is a time where you need to celebrate the arrival of your new baby. And if you are going to be bogged down with so many do's and don'ts, it can be really, really challenging. Isn't that interesting? And I'm sure you want to know more, get more details on how you can take care of yourself after you've had your baby. For more details, please follow me and visit www.baby360degrees.in for more programs and information.